The meaning of life is hard to see. It is hard to see whatever is coming at a particular point in time. Life is not a copy and paste logic. Situations can arise for anyone at any point in time. Every man and woman born into this world was brought into the battlefront because life is full of battles. That is why the scripture gives us a guideline as to how life must be approached in order for us to see its goodness. This is not to scare anyone, but to prepare you to face the task and the business of life squarely. Why is life so hard? There's a popular saying that life is not a bed of roses. We live in a world where individuals are faced with different problems, different circumstances, and different challenges in life. Some people get to see the end of the challenges and, sadly, some don't. Thinking about life itself will make you feel that life is worthless. You must know that everyone at different levels in life is faced with challenges. As the rich are faced with challenges, the same thing happens to the poor. The only difference is that the challenges are different, and the only similarity is the compound name, Challenge. Some people find it so hard to forgive themselves for some mistakes of the past that got them into their present predicaments. Know that life is a chore that must be done, a race that must be run, a hill that must be climbed, a river that must be crossed, and a purpose that must be fulfilled. Why is life so hard? Hmm. Have you engaged people who had a blooming past and now they are in one trouble or the other? Have you had from people who once lived a happy life but now life sort of means nothing to them? Have you heard conversations about people whose regrets in life were when they were given birth to? Have you talked to people living miserable lives? Then you're gonna see that there are different stages in life and there are also different problems and challenges attached to them. Someone said sometimes life crumbles everything around you and you are left to pick up the broken pieces. Life can seem so hard. The thoughts and fears of how do I even start again could kill some people when they have seen what they have walked for all their lives disappear and crumble before them. No one can say life is easy because in the real sense, life is difficult. It is also a relative statement because some people's lives have been planned right from birth and their challenges have been faced and solved by their parents. They've gotten what they always wanted without working so hard for it. So life is relatively easy for them. The reality of life shows up to these people maybe after the demise of their pillar, who could be their parents or mentor or guardian and they would certainly know, eventually, that life is not easy. Again, for some people, life seems so hard because we've attached our happiness to others. It looks like we're not ourselves, but rather we depend on what others will do in order to become happy and satisfied. Life is always difficult when we attach our happiness to others because human beings can disappoint at any time. We tend to trust friends and spouses and other close people and this level of trust brings about a level of dependence that we have on them. One of the things that you have to do is to try and always make yourself happy. It's not easy in most cases not to seek happiness from people, especially in the family setting where husbands attach their lives and happiness to their wives and vice versa. Most lives have been shattered in this process, which had left for mental unstableness and untimely death of so many people, and even though there is no justification for suicide. In my study through patterns and research, I've discovered that some reasons why life seems hard for some people and for others it doesn't just feel that way. I've found out that some people find it so hard to connect with others. Connecting with people is very important. Interpersonal relationships and social connections are essential because they can always help lower anxiety and depression. It can also help regulate our emotions and learn new things from people. Isolating yourself from people would make life difficult for you. A popular saying goes to us, if you want to go fast in life, move alone. If you want to go far in life, move with people. I once had a friend who found it hard to connect with people. Life was so hard for them that whenever he tried to relate, he gets hurt instead. Knowing this, you must learn and adapt to connect to people. It will help you in increasing your self-esteem and improve yourself and not feel intimidated. Again, Life seems so hard because we have fear of failure. We have fears in life and most often they come to pass. 
Someone once told me that to live a happy life, you've got to live freely and not care so much about what life throws at you. What are your greatest fears in life? To become successful? To marry early? And to achieve some feats before a certain age bracket? These things are good, but then you've got to live your life. Life is not fair to anybody and we often don't get what we deserve. We have various fears in life that we know that if they should happen, the effect on us might be great and might lead to us breaking down. You've just got to live your life and accept whatever is beyond your control. The Bible says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and now all other things shall be added to you. But for some people, they are doing the reverse. Instead of seeking God and his kingdom, they are rather pursuing the other things that are eventually going to be added to them. When you live life contrary to what the word of God has said, then it is inevitable that you will see life difficultly. Scriptures cannot be broken and the word of God is sure. So we must understand that for life to get easy, we must live according to the scriptures. Finally, in order to find solutions for the problems of life, you've got to first change yourself. Make positive changes within your personality. Identify those problems that can be solved by making changes in your daily routine or in your daily life. Life is sometimes hard because you've made so many mistakes. Do not ignore those mistakes or let those mistakes go without taking life lessons. When you will start taking your mistakes for life learning, then your attitude will become positive as well. You've got to learn to be patient. And it's a very hard fact to swallow, but it's true. If you want something in life, but you are not able to achieve it, it means life has something more significant and magnificent for you. Just have a strong faith and everything happens for a reason. Lastly, and I cannot stress this enough, do not compare yourself with anybody. Having a goal-oriented mind doesn't mean that you've got to follow someone else's goals. Be patient and work hard for your goals. If you can do all of these things, then life can be lived to the best of all desires and we're going to be content and comfortable with whatever changing scenes that life may present to us. God bless you.